Hello dear viewers, welcome to News and Brief from RJR Global Network. Ayatollah Shirazi condemns terrorist attack on Shia Mosque in Kuwait. With the widening scope of terrorist attacks and violence against Shia Muslims in different parts of the Islamic world, the Grand Jury Ayatollah Shirazi condemned the recent suicide attack on the Shia Mosque in Kuwait, which led to the martyrdom of more than 25 people and the injury of 227 others. His statement reads as follows. In the name of Allah, the compassionate, the merciful, surely we are Allah's, and to Him we shall return. In a holy month, in a holy day, and a holy place, the innocent people who were fasting and praying to their Lord were the victims of the criminal hand that spilled their blood in the mosque of Imam al in Kuwait. The history has to bear with the shame of this heinous carnage. This is the hand that murdered the best of the fasters and worshippers, the commander of the faithful Imam Ali, whom the pillars of guidance were eradicated by his martyrdom on the months of Ramadan and in the mosque of Kufa. This is the hand that has been involved in the unspeakable criminal acts along the history which murdered the sons of Imam Ali, the infallible leaders and the Shias who have suffered oppression in all times and places. All these heinous crimes and offenses are honors for the oppressed and nothing but a warning for the oppressors that their end is close. The victory is with followers of Prophet's household as the Prophet called them parallel to Koban. And I pray to Allah Almighty for the elevation of the ranks of all martyrs, the recovery of all the injured and hurt, and great rewards for the families of these worshippers. I advise all the respected believers, especially the injured nation of Kuwait, to honor memory of the murders as they deserve. I also beseech the Almighty to hasten the appearance of the Avenger of the Oppressors, our Master Imam Mahdi, may Allah's peace be upon him. Verily, Allah is near and answering. Ramadan 8th, 1436, June 26, 2015. Ayatollah Shirazi met different figures. At the daily meetings of the Grand Jury, so it's all sure as a number of scholars, religious, cultural, and social figures, masters of seminaries, Kwan University, and different groups of people from all over the world attended at the central office of Ayatollah Shirazi in the holy city of Qom and met the Grand Juries in different sessions. In these meetings, the visitors gave ear to the statements, advices, and guidelines of the Grand Jurists. Scholarly sessions at Ayatollah Shirazi's office. The 8th and 9th round of the scholarly sessions hosted a big number of scholars, researchers, seminary masters, and students at Ayatollah Shirazi's central office. In these gatherings, the Grand Jury Ayatollah Shirazi explains the questions and topics addressed by the attendees. It is noteworthy that following previous years, the scientific sessions are held each night at 12 to 1 a.m. Scholarly sessions at Ayatollah Shirazi's office in Holy Karbala. Simultaneously with the holy month of Ramadan, the office of the Grand Jury's Ayatollah Shirazi in the holy city of Karbala has held series of scholarly sessions. The sessions host scholars, seminary teachers, and students and discuss important topics in jurisprudence and beliefs. Culture and support programs by the Orphans Bloom Institute. Following the guidelines of Ayatollah Shirazi for helping the needy and poor families, the Cultural Center of Orphans Bloom has held several culture and support programs for the orphans and fatherless families. Moreover, mothers of the orphans took some courses under the title of Ramadan and received financial hopes. These programs were held in Holy Karbala.